Contact lenses can travel to the back of your eye and get lost there. Whoa. Today, we're on a myth-busting mission. Yes, you guessed it. We're tackling the wildest myths about contact lenses. And trust me, some of these will have you raising your eyebrows. So let's jump straight in and separate the fact from the fiction. Welcome back to Doc Hatch, where we dive into the world of eye care with a pinch of fun. First up, a classic. Contact lenses can travel to the back of your eye and get lost there. Whoa. Sounds like a horror movie, right? But here's the deal. It's physically impossible. The anatomy of your eye creates a barrier, so lenses cannot go wandering off. You see the white part of your eyeball? There's a covering there called the conjunctiva. That conjunctiva actually goes around the eye and under the eyelid so that there's a barrier and it's impossible for that lens to get lost. If your lens does feel lost, it's probably stuck under the lid. A little maneuvering and voila, you'll find it. If so far you like our video, please consider hitting the like and subscribe button to please the YouTube gods. Myth number two, kiss goodbye to contacts if you have astigmatism. Wrong. Technology has come a long way and now we have toric lenses specifically designed for astigmatism. They're like regular contacts but with a little extra magic to correct the blurred vision caused by astigmatism. Even if you have extreme forms like keratoconus, you can get special scleral lens fitting which would make your vision better than your glasses. So yes, astigmatism buddies, you can definitely join the lens club. While let others have all the fun. Now let's talk age. Mid 3 says kids and seniors can't wear contacts? This one's a big no. Age is just a number, especially when it comes to contact lenses. With proper care and responsibility, even kids can handle contacts. Even babies can sometimes be prescribed contact lenses if they've had something like cataract surgery. It helps with their neurological development. And for our graceful seniors, absolutely! Contacts can be a convenient alternative to glasses no matter your age, it all depends on your eyes and how they react. Alright, now myth 4. Sleeping in your contacts? No problem. Hold up. This one's a bit tricky. While some lenses are approved for overnight wear, most are not. Sleeping in the wrong type of contacts increases the risk of eye infection and irritation. See, the front part of your eye, the cornea, requires oxygen. Contact lenses deprive them of this, especially at night when the eye is shut and can get dry. This highly increases the risk of serious infections. Even with lenses that are approved for overnight wear, we see much higher rates of infection. Always check with your eye doctor to see what's safe for your eyes. Next, myth number 5. Contact lenses and sports are a bad combo. Not true. In fact, contacts can be a game changer for athletes. They don't fog up like glasses and you get a wider field of vision. Lenses can be the secret sports weapon. Just make sure to wear protective eyewear. Contacts do not replace these. Now for those thinking of swimming, contact lenses are not a great option. There are prescription goggles you can get to restore your eyesight, but do not wear lenses in the pool. This can genuinely be extremely dangerous. And finally, myth number 6. Contact lenses have no risk for infection, if only that were true. Contacts are safe, but they require proper hygiene to wear safely. Always wash your hands before handling them and follow your eye care professional's advice on care and replacement. A little care goes a long way in keeping you and your eyes healthy and happy. So there you have it folks, 6 contact lens myths busted. If you enjoyed our myth busting adventures today, Give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more eye-opening content. Until next time, keep those eyes sparkling and myth-free.